Hey guys, what's going on? Josh here from Polymathics, and today I'd like to talk about TAPS class, Transition Assistance Program class, for those of you who are unfamiliar with the term. This is what is used, this is what the, the government has provided for military members to help them have an easy transition out and hopefully get them employed in the workforce because even though they may not be working for the military anymore there's a good chance that they'll transition into a government job where they're still needed um, and so I have a question for you how many of you who are planning on transitioning have already signed up for TAPS class and also um, you know how much longer do you have until you get out are you approaching the six month mark if so, um, are you starting to feel a little nervous? Are you starting to, to get that anxiety a little bit? Um, if not, then I applaud you because when I was going through this situation, I definitely had a lot of things going on in my mind. Um, and we'll get, to, we'll get to some of these questions and, and discuss like the answers. But first, I want to talk about a quote from an unlikely person. Oprah Winfrey. Um, she's she said um, before that she believes that luck is when preparation meets opportunity, and I couldn't agree with her more. Um, now, why do I bring up Oprah? For those of you that may not know, um, and I just found this out recently, but Oprah was born. Um, to, her mother was 13 years old when she had her and so and then she was raised and as you can probably assume in a um, in a kind of bad environment and from what I understand she was sort of abused both sexually and physically um, or sexually and verbally as she grew up and then at the age of 13 she herself had a child but it was a it was a stillborn and then um, she had a stillborn birth and then I guess shortly after that she ended up in juvenile um, prison um, or juvenile hall but the point is for those of us who know Oprah Winfrey now we would never have assumed that she came from such a background and that shows a lot about her character and um, and the challenges that she faced and, and things like that you are in nowhere near as bad of a situation but um, but the fact still remains that in order to create luck for yourself you're going to have to prepare and that way when the opportunities arise you'll be ready to go and TAPS class is one of the best preparation uh, tactics that you can use for your transition. And you're probably getting all kinds of um, advice from friends. And I'm not going to lie, although there, there are some standards to the class, it's not always taught by the same people. Um, or in the same format, um, they're just some basic standards that they that they apply. So um, there's a very good chance that someone who went to one base had a great taps class, and someone else didn't get quite as much. But even if you were only able to get one tiny little piece of information from any one of those classes that they have it would still be worth it to go because when you are going through this transition you're gonna need every piece of information every every reference every reference point that you can get so that when you are turning in your resumes um, trying to network getting a uh, you know phone calls and going in for the interviews that you can feel confident and bold that you've gone through the right process 
and preparation. Now, um, so so TAPS has its pros and its cons, and I'm going to have another video discussing the cons. But right now, we're just talking about the pros. Um, it's free. It's got a boatload of very basic information, but even so when I went to TAPS I went in there with a kind of smug attitude thinking what are they gonna teach me that I don't already know about dressing professionally about networking about turning in resumes because aren't resumes just the same thing as an EPR uh, you know uh, an evaluation like to me it seemed like a bit of a joke and so I waited um, almost till the last minute to do mine and thank God that they had a spot open for me and thank God that I went because I was one of the lucky people who had not just a good but a phenomenal instructor um, or instructors throughout the the course of that week and um, and there was just so much valuable information and the only thing I wish was that there was some way to have um, to have had it in a format like this where I could go back and reference it and that's why that's one of the main purposes that I've made about face in, in the whole it, in the whole beginning of, of my thought process was I want a repository on a, on a well-known place like YouTube that service members can go to and reference for all of this you know information because it, it sometimes we need um, repetition to remember sometimes we have to go back and anyways I'm getting off off topic so the point is um, for those of you who are like me who waited or for those of you who who are like me and just didn't think that it was that big of a deal uh, I'm telling you you're wrong I'm telling you you're at the least gonna have one good piece of information that you can take back with you and use for your job search, your interview, your transition in general. So I highly recommend you do that. The other thing I highly recommend is that you plan in advance. If you're getting to or you're at the six month mark, you gotta, you gotta sign up as soon as possible. And the reason why I say that is in some areas, depending on where you are, the, it can it can fill up really really quick and it can fill up the entire region so I was speaking to a sailor today um, who was talking about the, the Baltimore Washington region and every taps class in all the bases for the next four months or so is completely booked completely that means that anybody who's getting out within that time who hasn't scheduled it already is going to have to really fight for a spot in there or they're just not going to get it and I really I feel terrible for them because it's such it's such a loss of of so much vital information that they're going to get and and even the networking in general like the people that you get to meet um, you know can, that can be very beneficial so I hope this video has been um, has been helpful and and if you if you have been thinking you know taps is around the corner or you know it's getting around six month mark or maybe it's already past that I'm telling you go tomorrow put in action go today request from whatever chain of command that you have to go through to get your get yourself signed up as soon as possible because you don't want this opportunity to pass you by um, and uh, and with that so with that being said um, I can't think of anything else that I'd like to add but uh, uh, I'll catch you on the next video take it easy